of dreams, isn't it? It's tea bag. We're very sad, yeah. We're very, very sad indeed, yeah. I think I can... This week, Polly heads for Hollywood, where film director Max Clapper is searching for a star. Who is the Scarlet Lady? Will she nab the next gold ring? Will Elmer Z. Schoedberger pull off the deal of the decade? Who's double-crossing who? Stay tuned to T-Bag and the Rings of Olympus. For your movie. I'm still searching, nah. What's wrong with her? Uh, I worked with that dame on Ben Hur. All she ever did was complain. Never could get the hang of pulling that chariot. Nah. Oh, holy cow, this is a nightmare. I gotta find someone for that part like now. I've been thinking. I know a little lady who'd be just hunky dory. Yeah? Ooh. Me? Say again. Me. One more time. Me! I could play the lead part of Scarlet of Sugar to perfection. Honey, in the movie, Scarlet is supposed to be 14 years old. Well, I can play 14. Gee, shucks, Daddy. Can I please have a pony for Christmas? Oh, please, Daddy, please. Well, what do you say, Max? Any more dried prunes? Oh, give me a break, Max. I haven't had a decent part in the movies for I don't know how long. Oh, no, hang in there, babe. The right part will turn up for you soon one of these days, but I'm afraid this ain't it. Oh. You gotta understand. Over at MGM, they're making this big blockbuster gone with the wind. Well, I'm gonna take the wind right out of the sails with a blockbuster of my own. Exit with a puff. Great title, honey. In 50 years' time, no one's gonna remember Gone with the Wind. But Exit with a puff will surely become the greatest movie classic of all time. I don't doubt it, darling. But that's why the casting has got to be perfect. Especially the part of Scarlet. It's gotta be right. I need me a 14-year-old girl. But where, oh, where am I gonna find me one? Nah, nah, nah. Yes, that monocle. <gasps> the winds of fortune are blowing right up my hooter this morning T-shirt. Here we go again. We off then? No, 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 not yet. You know what they say, fools rush in where angels fear to tread. So, we're gonna do our homework this time. Uh, oh. Max, relax. It'll all come together. You'll see. Oh, I'd better had. I start shooting my movie at 2 o'clock, and if I don't have a scarlet, I'm gonna start shooting myself by 201. Trust me. Call it feminine intuition, call it what you will. But I get the feeling in my bones that the perfect scarlet of sugar's gonna turn up out of the blue this very morning. Oh, I hope your bones are right, honey dumpling. I just hope they're right. I do believe I see a way of bagging the next gold ring. Don't tell me. You're gonna go to the studio, dress yourself up, do a stunning audition, land yourself the part of Scarlet O Sugar, and demand the gold ring as your fee for starring in the movie. Oh, I was gonna hit him over the head with a baseball bat, but <laughs> come to think of it, that's a nifty idea you got there, T-shirt. It might work. Of course it'll work, unless you muck it up. Meaning? Meaning fools rush in, like you said. Why don't you let me go first? Soften him up a bit before you go barging in like a rhinoceros with horn ache. What do you mean, soften him up a bit? Here's what I mean. Ah, why are you whispering in my ear, you dumb skull? There's nobody else here. Oh, give me strength. Morning, everyone. Hi, Mr. Clapper. Nancy, Max, any news from the casting people yet? Oh, this is insane. Who'd be a famous film director? 20 years in the business, and what have I got to show for it? A row of Oscars on my mantelpiece and a row of ulcers in my stomach. Keep trying, Nancy. I'm depending on you. Ah! Hi, Schoedberger. Pardon me? Alma Z. Schoedberger. I'm sure you've heard of me. Uh-uh. What? You never heard of Alma Z. Schoedberger? Get with it, Clapper. I'm only the most high-powered actor's agent in the whole of Hollywood. Schoedberger doesn't ring a bell. Doesn't ring a bell, Clapper? Are you insane? I've got more stars in the Milky Way. 
Your problems are over, Maxie, baby. I got just the gal you're looking for. Yeah? Yes, sirree. Tabitha the bag, a name to conjure with. Is she young? Is she pretty? Can't she act? She tells, she tells. You want to see her or not? You got a picture? No, but I can get you one. I don't have much time, Shirtburger. A picture will be on your desk, too sweet, Maxie, baby. Catch you later. So I said, Max, I said, you're going to make yourself ill if you don't go easy. But he will insist on throwing himself into his work. I'm just glad he doesn't work at the sewage farm. Excuse me. Got to go, Hetty. Someone at the door. Love and kisses, darling. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Can I help you? Well, I hope so. You see, I'm <gasps> looking for... You are Scarlet. No, I'm Polly, actually. Young, pretty. Can you act? You're ideal. You're perfect. Wait till my husband hears about this. He'll be tickled pink. You're a gift from the gods, my dear. Sent from heaven to save us. Hello, Max. Dolores. Uh, Dolores Clapper, your wife? <laughs> Listen, I think I found your perfect scarlet of sugar. I'm telling you, she's exactly right for the part. Oh, she has the sweetest little... Max, he hung off. How do you like that? Well, you, little lady, are going to play the lead part in Max's new movie. Would you like that? Well, I... He'd pay you anything you ask for, you know. Yeah? Mm -hmm. In that case, lead me to the studio. Uh, hold your horses. He's got to see a photograph first. And if he likes the photo, you're in. Now, you stay right there, my pretty angel, while I go and I get my camera. Smile. Will you smile? Ah, I'm smiling. You look as if a number 16 bus has just reversed into your face. Come on, let's see those gnashers. I don't. Horrible, but a little laugh to do. Say cheese. Get on with it. There. Got it. Well, it's the best we're going to get. Hmm. Holy guacamole. That's my scarlet. Shirtburger was right. There's only one gal going to star in my movie, and that's Tabitha D-Bag. Nancy, get me Elmer's D Shirtburger. Oh, now that's what I call efficient. Shirtburger, am I glad to see you. I said I'd be back, so I'm back now about my client. Miss the bag? She's got the part. Huh? Here's the <laughs> script. We start shooting at 2 o'clock. Tell her congratulations. Glad to have her on board. Any questions? No. Oh, yeah. Uh, what about the, uh, the fee? <laughs> the fee. Oh, of course, the fee. <laughs> oh, you're a sharp operator, Shirtburger. How does a million bucks a week sound? Well... Okay, two million tops. Um... Oh, you're a top cookie shirt burger. Two and a half million, that's my final offer. Um... Three and a half. Four. Five. Shirt burger, name your price! I want your monocle. Sorry. For a moment there, I thought you said you wanted my monocle. I did, it's what I want. Your monocle. No monocle, no movie. You're crazy. Okay, if that's your attitude. Stop! It's a deal, it's a deal! Look, we've shaken on it. There's no going back. Clapper, you've got yourself a star. Okay, fellas, let's get this show on the road. Action with a puff. What a load of bunkum have you rolled me into. You sound through it's a breeze. Come on, I'll help you learn your lines. I do hope that I have the star role I trust. Need you ask? No doubt. The minute he saw my photo, he was completely bowled over. Well, <laughs> that's understandable. Uh, yeah, something like that. Come on now. It's all good stuff. You play the part of Scarlet O Sugar, a beautiful, fresh faced 14 year old slip of a girl. <laughs> what are you <laughs> laughing at? Nothing. I can remember what it was to be 14, you know. Well, that was only seven years ago. Yeah, sure. Oh, let's get on with this rubbish. Right. The American Civil War is raging, and young... Young! <laughs> Sorry. Young Scarlet sits waiting for news of her classroom sweetheart, Rhett Butter, who has run away to join the army as a drummer boy. Oh, 
Now what, twiddle twaddle? A brain dead stick insect could come up with a better plot. Q Scarlet. <sighs> oh, oh me. Oh my. Well, found my bra. Oh, where, where, where can my little wreck be? Oh me, oh me, oh me. Oh me, oh my, oh me. That boy has done broken my heart in two. I swear he has. Why, some nights I lie awake, lie awake in my bed. I swear I can almost hear the tap, tap, tapping of his little drum drifting across the old cotton fields. Hark! Oh, am I dreaming now? Or is that my brave little drummer boy? Yonder horizon. Oh, 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 me, oh, my, oh, me, oh, what is it? I know that. Oh, my, oh, me. Cut, cut, cut. Okay, fellas, it's a wrap. Go home. We'll start again tomorrow. Shake burger, come here. What kind of stunt are you trying to pull on me here? Huh? That picture must have been taken 50 years ago. Why, I ought to... Oh, oh, I'm going home to curl up and die. I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, well, what do you think of my performance so far? Madam, a word hasn't yet been invented to adequately describe your performance. Oh, Dad, you hear that? He loves me. Understand it, Polly. He must have got the photograph hours ago. Well, maybe he doesn't think I'm right for the part. Wait till I get my hands on that man. How dare he not call me back? What a day! Don't ask. I don't want to talk about it. You'll never believe what happened. Some half pint jumped up brat of an agent, leaves me a picture of the perfect scarlet of sugar. Beautiful she was. Just like you, honey. Then what happens? He comes back later and tries to pass off some old turkey as the same girl. Can you believe the nerve? We had to start shooting with Scarlet O' Sugar looking like Rip Van Winkle in a wig. It's enough to make a grown man weep, I tell you. <laughs> you! How oh, was uh, she... You, big booby! Didn't you read my note in the back of the photograph? I told you to ring me right away! You mean you? Oh, oh, holy baloney! I gone and booked the wrong Scarlet! Oh, kid, what can I say? The part's yours. Name your price. I don't care what it costs. Let's not beat about the bush. Let's start at five million. There's only one thing I want. Six million, seven, anything! Your monocle. I'm gonna have to see a doctor about these ears, Dolores. Your monocle and I'll do it. What is it with the monocle? It's a deal. Shake the girl's hand, Max. Deal. Deal. Morning, everybody. Are we all ready to make motion picture history here today? Yes, sir. Three boss. How do I look? Oh, Dolores, look. There's my scarlet. I knew she'd be perfect. It's all just perfect. And look at this marvelous set. I can almost smell that southern breeze blowing through the cotton fields. <laughs> oh, well, you see the battle scene we've got lined up. There's going to be lots of smoke over here and a huge explosion right here. It's going to be sensational. Are you ready, honey bunch? As ready as I'll ever be. Okay, sweetie. If you'd like to sit on the bench for me, right. Lights! Camera! Action! Oh, me, oh, my. Well, found my brown. Where, oh, where can my little red be? Oh, me, oh, my. Isn't she just great? She's star material, sure enough. That boy has done broken my heart in two, I swear he has. Some nights, while I lie awake in my bed, I swear I can almost hear the tap, tap, tap of his little tea bag. What? What's going on here? Cut, cut, cut! Somebody around here seems to have got their wires crossed. I am playing Scarlet Oh Sugar, not her. Yeah, that's the big idea, Clapper. You promised this part to my client here. That was yesterday. This is today. Get real, Shirtburger. This is showbiz. If you can't stand the heat, stay out of the spotlight. Oh, you two-faced, double-crossing twister. Don't you talk to my husband like that. I'll give you a big face out of Would it. Would you Jerry. clear the set? We're trying to make a movie here. You ain't making a movie. 
Bag in no movie without Mr. Bag in the lead. Well, tough luck and too bad, cos I'm playing it. You tell him, Polly girl. I'm gonna sue you for every cent you got, Clapper. We did a deal. Ah, deal, Schmiel. What? Yeah, what? Right? Say again? Oh, what? Yeah. No, I can't. What? What do you say? Yes, I don't know. Shut up! Thank you. Okay, Nancy, now what's wrong? What? You're kidding. No, tell me it isn't true. Oh, no! Oh, no, no, no! No, 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 no! no, no. Bad news? I just lost my red butter. The kid walked out on me. I'm gonna see to it that that Mickey Rooney never works in this town again. Where am I gonna find me a 14-year-old boy to star in my movie? I, uh, think I might be able to help you out there, Clapper. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Know what I'm doing? No, oh, I have oh. What do you reckon then, Clapper? Am I in? You're, You're in. in. There is just the uh, little matter of my fee. <laughs> Five million, ten million, a million, a million. No, don't tell me. I know the monocle. You got it. Oh, give me a break, kid. I promised the monocle to the. Okay, it's yours. But keep stum about it. Stum's the word. Now can we make a movie? Scene one, take two, action! Oh, am I dreaming? Or is that my brave little drummer boy returning from the war over yonder horizon? Howdy, Scarlet. Why, Red, you came back. Nothing could keep me from your arms, Scarlet. The battle draws nearer, my love, and so do we. Oh, Red, hold me. Hold me tight in your big, strong arms. I don't know what you think you're playing at. He's promised that monocle to me. That's what you think. He's promised it to me. You little rat. You're not having it. Says who? Says me. Oh, yeah? Yeah. We'll see about Cut. that. Cut. 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 Oh, for Perry's sake. I should have done this in the first place. You and your pathetic plans. Oh, no, no, I told you my way was best. But, oh, no, no, you wouldn't listen. You and your idiotic plans. Wow, well, never again. From now on, we do things my way. Is that clear? You idiot! Get out of my sight and get back to the tea room this minute! Whoa, Miss Polly Polly Peewee Poodle Brain. <laughs> what do you think of this, eh? Your little feeble plan blew right up in your face. <laughs> what happened? Looks like Exit with a puff just went up in smoke. Oh, I've had it with this movie. I'm gonna make something else instead. That's it! lady you just gave me a great idea for my next movie the bride of frankenstein starring dolores clapper oh man oh dolores oh, uh mr clapper um i know we didn't finish the film have it have it thanks well that's one in the eye for tea bag <laughs> <laughs> Frankly, my dear, I don't give a fig. Next week, Polly hits the streets of old London town. Who exactly is the weasel? And where did he pop up from? Can Polly find the next gold ring? Or is she up another blind alley? What dirty rat is ferreting about in the weasel's lair? Find out in next week's spine-chilling episode of Teabag and the Rings of Olympus.
Oscar. Oh, I'd love to start with you. Now, star. Scully, yeah. have you yeah. heard the latest track from The Big Chill? The Big Chill, my favourite band. Well, no. Put this on. Oh. You listen to the. Oh, oh my new girl. The Big over Chill. There. You enjoy that. Oh. You go for that. Oh.